Austin, Texas. The original F. Scientó. What happens when lots of Scientology protesters take the streets of Austin? Are you ready to find out? The Full Power protest starts today, May 9th, at the Pearl Fest in Austin. Lara has traveled from Los Angeles. Liz traveled from Sacramento and Cheryl and Lori are here from Clearwater. And last but not least, Selfless is of course also there. This will interbulate the Scientologists and I think the group will get a visit later. Is this real, guys? Oh, who can guess who it is? Yeah, wait, do we need to reset it? Yeah. We need to reset it. Reset, we'll be back. Oh, Go we have a nontology. That's interesting. Oh my God, this is great. <laughs> I knew DOA was taking a break, but I didn't realize he came to Austin. Interesting. Oh my god. So hot. Guys, look. Sister Lilith from Hell is there. A little ontology. Just in case. I know everyone's like priestess if anyone gets arrested, okay? Yes. So I can get to come in and get you out of jail. Don't mess with don't oh, mess. You don't know me. Bye, hun. But I watch y'all all the time and I protest as well. Amazing. And I'm silver blue. And I'm just cruel to meet you. Oh. Oh you guys. I am just thrilled. We are too. We we literally so, are too. Maybe a long time before you get back here. Which ones are the chairs? So I have to stay to see y'all. Um, and that's my sister over there. She lives with me. Should I go say hi? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Remember that you left. Austin, Laura, Ben is here. No more kids in Scientology. told me to come and say hi. <laughs> hi, who are you? Laura, hi, FF. Laura. I'm nice Teresa. to meet you. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you too. How cute is this? You know why I bring her? Why? For support. Oh, she would say, yeah. Uh, you know, I know them. Yeah. I'm familiar with their work. Yeah. Or you just they avoid it like the play. Lily from Hell is here. <laughs> Little ontology. Just in case. I'm everyone's high priestess if anyone gets arrested, okay? Yes. So I can get to come in and get you out of jail. Don't mess with me. Laura, you don't know me. Hi, hun. But I watch you all the time and I protest with her. Amazing. And I'm silver because I'm And I'm she silver And I'm silver girl. Oh, you guys. So the only entrance is this on the other side? So they come out this door. We've seen all the entrances now on the stream, guys. They come out this door, front door, the side door, or the back. It's not like Clearwater, where they got like 20,000 exits, right? Specifically designed. I don't see any black socks in there. DOA, are you in there? DOA, DOA. DOA, come out with your cans up. Now my toys come that was a pretty good impersonation, right? <laughs> oh, the paparazzi are already here. Then I have to show my best side. Awesome. By the way, I am not Tom Cruise, just in case you're wondering yes. who I am. Yep. I love that. What's up, Marsha? It's a chilled atmosphere. People are joking around, protesting loudly, and DOA's minivan is driving rounds. Lara, Pearl, and Liz have been there for about 10 minutes when the first visitor arrives. What is going to happen? I found. Oh, in the cold. Look who I found. Hello. Hey, y'all. Is this that badass drummer I saw the other night at Viper? Yeah. Freaking no singer way. I saw there. It's amazing. Us. How's it going? Oh my right. goodness. Hello, everybody. How was the flight? 
awesome. I freaking fell asleep and then I woke up and then the, we're here, guys. We're here and I'm here. Used to it. Yeah, security's like that. Lara FM. Yeah, that's right. Wrong yeah, you know, that's right. Right. Uh, what did you do to pull this in? <laughs> How you doing? What? What's going on? What do you mean? What's going on? Uh, Woo! First of all, what's going on? What is going on? This is another guys? false call from Scientology, guys. I don't know what, what, what's happening. I don't know. No, I mean, we are drunk. Somebody nope, nope. This is all made up. They don't want us protesting. We're using our our amendment. Yeah, it's a false call, guys. This happens every time we protest. They, the Scientologists call and fake calls so that you guys try to come and get one of us arrested. Do you even know the nature of the call? Yeah, for yeah. Could we ask what it was? Probably somebody armed with a handgun. No. Yeah, this is what they do every this, time. Can we get your serial number too, just so we have this for the record? The norm. This is the norm. This is like number five. Yeah. Just so you know, we have the we're just just out. so you don't waste your energy and that you're aware of no, us. No, we, you gotta understand, we gotta come out. Absolutely, you know, I'm letting you know so that maybe nice something can be done on the other end of getting them investigated. Like, go let's find out who's picking up that phone and Hopefully making those calls because they're doing this all over the states. Calls. Guys, let me let me talk in the radio here. Okay. Yeah. Another fake call, guys. We're streaming for this reason. So that so you guys can look back at our streams and everything. But I just got here ten minutes ago and they know. They know who I my dad and I was born and raised in this. My father's stuck in this. They're abusing they abused. I was we we were both abused in this whole as kids. We were trained to be security. We were auditing people at young ages about masturbation and older men and what's the name of your stream? I gotta ask. Lara F M. L A R A F M. Yeah. Amos and Mary? As in like a radio station. Yeah. I sing music, yeah, yeah. so I sing, I'm a rocker. Yeah. So they're like, that chick has something. Like, nah, just my voice, baby. Yep. Just my voice. And they, they created it. Yep. So, yeah. So just, just so you guys know, that is, that is the norm here. Just, just to be clear. Yeah. Y'all didn't see anybody. Nope. There was nobody. absolutely nobody. And they've actually been around here for hours streaming. And so when I showed up, they did this. They do this because I'm a. Okay. okay. I'm very, very clear. And yeah, same with Pearl Snapping. That's her stream. Lara is just good at explaining the situation with her as a child of Scientology and the situation as a protester. And most importantly, they listen. Just Texas and Los Angeles and maybe that maybe Denver, Colorado or, Los An or of Swati. Of Swati people because they come in hard and like, oh, and it's just like we're innocent people, literally. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. so it's so now we've gotten our thickness up. So when you walk by, I was like, I, I, ain't, I ain't here to do this. But if it's a yeah, squatting call, yeah, know. we want you to know it's we can don't waste your time and do whatever you have to do. Yeah, but eight minutes, Pearl, just eight minutes. Did wasn't don't I get a record of something? Yeah, no, I think you that got is fastest something. That's, that's, you got something. That is, I think no, I got that the is fastest, fastest time that the that police have been called, called on like us for sure. Like this, because I showed um, up. But also, you got the Within first six time minutes, the campus. Like you got this is the first time campus has showed up. Normally, it's APD um, or TCO. Yeah, they wanted to make this one loud and clear. But and I'm like, I'll tell them quietly. Our Travis County Sheriff's Office. These folks say that they're not just training this whole time. Yep. They didn't see. We're anti-Scientology protesters, and this is the norm for them to call fake and fake so that we, look, I was born and raised in this. I know what they're doing. We're just letting you know. No, I know um, the APD knows. Yeah, yeah, know. they do this know. Is, but what I do request, months. guys, since you are on camera and I know, please do an invest. Please have somebody be like, they're going to keep doing this. They're going to keep calling in fake calls. And this isn't okay. Like, they should know, like, you don't do this to try they're to get using shot. Voip, though, a shot. Like, you don't use the, the law and your guys is important. And they don't pay taxes. They don't do anything. Okay, so I'm just gonna low, I'm gonna keep it calm so I can save that for protesting. But yeah, just do the, let somebody do an investigation on who's picking up that phone call or whatever it is and making that call. Because if they could arrest somebody, then they would probably stop doing that across all the states. It's not just Texas, guaranteed. Seven swattings in, in the last month in Los Angeles. Yeah, normally I get the long guns pointed at me because yep. they come full they code. They have guns to their head. It's just like, I'm like, that's, that's my so friend. fun. Oh my God. Because that's better just not, not safe for us either finger. or any of the like, college students. Don't be you know? triggered. Like, that's like, that's. And like, we're so not that's also fearful. Armed. Like, we have cameras in our mouths. Literally. Like, we're like, no, go back on. Here's my evidence. Go back on the live stream. It's so simple. Right? It's like, that's I why we started live streaming. That's true. 
Thank you guys for being here. How many yeah, people? Yeah, we got appreciate you, you stopping to chat with us. It's amazing. We do. No, we, we totally understand. Do. You have to respond to these calls so that you yep. like, doesn't look like there's havoc or somebody going nuts. Nope. Well, and it's even more terrifying when school's in, totally. right? Because there's, there's all those kids. students. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like 50,000 undergraduates and 20,000 grad they students. They know That's what the not white thing has to say to make the cars come out. And I want, I beg you, I mean, we're going to stay here. So I beg you guys, please, if, if they do it again today or tomorrow or the next day, please, like somebody's got to be like, warn them. Have say, you will absolutely have the right to come out here. Yeah. And when you all seem like you know the we do. I was born and raised in this. I used to do this as a child. Well, no, I but we, to, I know the protesting this laws. Def, this one definitely knows the laws more than I do I, I, about I, protesting. I've very awesome conversations with the APD about it. They're super cool. Yeah. Oh, well, there's a family member behind you. Yeah. There's two of them. Yeah. Well, well yeah, the one it. guy They're hit his face. That's the guy here. that I will that I'm pressing assault charges against. So that's fun for up. him. I mean, he sprayed me down with a power washer. <laughs> like, what an idiot. It's too hot to be an F. Oh, we're just protesting Scientology. What are you doing? Sir, can I ask you some questions about the Sea Org and Scientology? Sea Org members are supposed to have the freedom to communicate to anybody, right? The communication is a universal solvent. I was born and raised in the Sea Org. My dad is Phil Anderson. He's washing dishes at the Blue Building in Los Angeles. It's not okay for children to be auditing older men and for older men to be asking children about masturbating and pedophilia and getting away with that during auditing. Auditing is not an excuse to be illegal. Did you know that? The Scientology is not above the law. Please tell Phil Anderson and, and the elderly people that work on staff that are getting abused, you should be getting help. I see you have a little... I, I see you have a little scab on your neck. You should get some medical care for that. There's a whole community out here. There's a whole community out here that'll help you. The SPTV, the SPTV Foundation can help you get out. Not only the Austin PD was there, the campus police were also called. They didn't waste your time today, gentlemen. Yeah, so... Uh, uh... Uh, did they did they say anything about them calling for service? Yeah, have a good one. Did they call y'all? Can you can you let us know what their complaint was, sir? Was I naughty? One of the officers is upset that he is being asked questions about the call of service and that he is being filmed. Let's not forget, the officers are filming too. Officers have to live with being filmed in public while doing their duty. The officer claims that the call did not come from Scientology and that it has nothing to do with the protesters. So why do they go into the Scientology building? Have any charges been brought upon them for for, for uh, false calling? Or is that not a thing in Texas? I'm retired law enforcement okay. from Florida. Let me ask you this. Yes, sir. Last question. Yes, sir. Do y'all have a problem with the law enforcement? No, sir. I love, I'm retired okay. law enforcement. That's my, you're my family. Do anything, but y'all want to come get cameras? No, I'm just asking oh, hold on, hold on. you. Let me finish. Y'all want to come surround us with cameras when we, we, whenever we arrive, we get here? Y'all want to come? I was sitting come? in my chair. I didn't okay. surround you, but Your buddy here? Oh, oh, sir, I've been sitting in my chair the whole time. Okay, just hang on. Just hang on. Just hang on. Okay, and I'll stand right here. Yes, sir. You get up, you turn your camera to where it's facing us, you start talking to the camera. Because I want to know what's going on. I know. Okay. I mean, you, you yeah, come as, up, as prior law enforcement. You can't already get up those stairs. If you if you did work prior law enforcement, you know we're not going to discuss the case with somebody that's not involved, right? Not not necessarily, because we know they called that you they called you about us. No, actually, they didn't. Really? That's yeah, interesting. So actually, they did not call. Scientology did not call. Then why did they go into the building? They didn't want to talk to the protesters. It happens. It happens. But I appreciate you talking so, so to me. My, question is, of, uh, my only question is, is why is it when we come up, y'all want to come surround us with cameras and start bombarding us with questions? Why does he feel offended? It was a question about the call of service. Hang on. Do you, do you, under, do you, do you understand, though, that when we're here do, having our peaceful uh, protest and then six cops come up and, 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 and did any of them come up and do anything with y'all somebody somebody one of y'all told one of the other guys that it was a weapons call okay okay so all right so but, but we they, were the only people but, but outside did, other than come, them but did, but did they come up to y'all and treat y'all like y'all were a suspect anything like that no and that's why i and i didn't okay. think i came so, up to you in a harassing so, way i i, th I well, just but, was but asking is, what the call was the if, point that you want to stand here with your phone and, and report in our conversation Oh, because I'm live streaming. I can't leave it over there. And, 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 and what I'm saying, because we have to. 
Okay. That, that, that's, part, so that's, part, that's part of our policy. It's part of my life. I don't, hey, I, I don't like that. You know, that's what you do. So my thing is, is y'all want to have the conversation, but then this is how y'all want to want to react to it. Okay? Well, w- and, would you? And, 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 and to come and treat us this way. Would you be willing to tell me what the call was if, if just you and I and I put my I give my somebody else my camera? Me and the police. It's good now. But this is new now with the with the campus. They're new. I don't know what that is. I'm not getting involved. They're used to getting paid by Scientology for little events. But they they have a gray line with Scientology, so they protect the little. APD. So, but and and some of these people are new, but most of APD knows. And the fire marshal has refused, said, no more public events for Scientology because of what they pulled during the opening weekend. Good. And because all the dope-ass people in my chat yeah. and all of our chats yeah. called the city council, called said, the fire yep. marshal, and the fire marshal admitted that they did some stuff behind his back. If it was up to him, he wouldn't have done it, and they yep. will not be working with them anymore. And he wonders why we're upset right. when they show up. Right. And only yeah. with certain people. He was only, all the other officers, one saw I was getting little, and he was like, okay, okay, so let me- Thank you, Pam, appreciate you. call on the radio. Person. You are. You're just so pretty. Aww. And all my quirky ways. Pop! The fire marshal, get out of here. Yeah, right? Don't hey. tell Jess. Okay. Who is it? Let Silver. everybody. I don't have a YouTube channel, but Silver is someone. What's happening? I feel like I really I thought they were going to arrest someone the for a minute left. A- APD is really <gasps> chill. Really? I've built a very good relationship with them. They admitted to Selfless and I that they were watching our videos and knew what fair game was. They knew what they were doing to us. Yes. So these people, and so when you see them in the evening, so the, I know most of the evening shift people, they are completely different. They'll come up, they talk to me. One of the, there was a point where a Scientologist, we'll see him later tonight because he's part of the foundation org, came up to me and got in my face, got in my face, okay? And like would not back off. And, there, and it was down walks LA was behind me and he was yeah. in my fit just keeping those Whatever TRs in like, would not back up that police officer yeah. goes I'm you, you want to talk about being body routed away that police officer was just like just like ripped him by the shoulder and took him away and he was just like gave me the sign to be like don't say another word but I didn't say another word and he escorted him away and that was the end of it and that guy has our back and he's the one that's like uh, I watched the videos I watched your videos I watched the videos of the survivors that you put on your sign so I know what's going on. I know what dead agenting is. I know what fair game is. I know what they're doing to you. So the captains, the lieutenants are starting to, it's starting to go both directions, right? And now I have a detective looking into the phone assault case. So there's actually a detective. So I, he called yesterday. We've been playing a little bit of phone tag, but he is looking into it. I think they got him and got him on other charges, right? Yes. So like for all the people that were just like, that was an assault, get over it. Turns out it was. Yeah. Um, and so they are going after it. And then the I am pressing charges on three things, but I'm not going to be explicit about what or where because I don't want them to know all the things. And I don't want all y'all to, like, go buck wild on the Instagrams and the Reddits and the things. Pull out your tissue because this situation is a heartbreaker. How are you, ma'am? Wait for your ride? You want to... Do you have any Scientology stories you want to tell me about? No, not feeling it today? Are you happy with your life here? I'm fine. Yeah, would you like to be able to make your own choices, though, instead of following suit? I mean, do you ever think of retirement? And and yeah, you, do you have, like, money set aside for yourself for retirement? I don't. Okay. You know, I just, I, I'm, I, don't want, I don't want to cause you any problems, but I want you to know that there are organizations out there that will help you if you need a place to stay, if you need a job, they'll actually pay you living wages. SPTVFoundation.org. And the number is 727-266-5797. I don't know if you can write it down or if, if you can remember it. But they... 626-5797. Yeah, it's, it's 727-266-5797. And we would love to help you have your own life and, and set yourself up for the future. God bless you, ma'am. Have a great day. Wow. She has nothing. She has nothing, you guys. That broke me. This movement exists precisely for cases like this. People who need help need to know that they have a choice, that they can be helped if they decide to leave Scientology. But it's not just the elderly who need help. He was more interested in an asshole with bad teeth. No, what? Talk to an old lady over there waiting for a ride. 
just had to ask her if she wanted to share anything about her life in Scientology. She said no. And I, and I said, well, I just want you to know that there's or, there are organizations that will help you get set up for your future. I said, do you have anything put aside for retirement? She probably was 75 at least. She said no, she didn't have anything. I don't know, it just broke me. She was, she has, she has nothing. She's, she's social security age and she has nothing. <laughs> That, right. Well, they never put into. And there's a there's a, a door with stairs coming down, and she was standing at that corner waiting for her ride to pick her up. Oh, really? Yeah. So they and they pulled up as I as I was talking, so I wrapped up. But the past is fast and slowing through my head. The past is fast and slowing through my head. The past is fast and slowing through my head. I'm learning. I'm learning and loving with you, you and you. I'm with you, you, you. I'm with you and you and you. You got me learning. I'm loving, learning and loving with you. We're looking at some BTs right now. OMG. Is this, is this a like... Cheryl is such a creative person. She makes these little crocheted body seedings, also called BTs. They are so cute. Ah, uh, guys. TOA, are you still in the chat? Thank you, 86 GOP. Look at this. I've got a landing strip. <laughs> How cute. Oh, is this Okay, that's, oh my God. <laughs> what is going on? Guys. Yes, oh my God, these are so... Amazing. Oh, we can have a channel. Yeah. They're finally lined up, guys. All four of them. When you do a show, you've got a little microphone. Oh, my God. Wait, burrito. wait, guys. Hold on. Wait, and. Super burrito with me. Shrimp tacos, it's not me. I don't know. 